let's take UX Pilot and generate with it the same interface with different design styles, from minimalist to no brutalist. It is very easy to do. Let's get started. Okay, in this video, I want to show you how I create different design styles for the same screen I generate with UX Pilot. First of all, I created different prompt styles. Let's take a look on them. Here I have a prompt for minimalist design. I write in the prompt, what is minimalist design? Here's the explanation and then the visual layout principles, as you can see here, like the grid based structure, clear visual hierarchy and more. And at the bottom of the prompt, I add also the primary color I want to use. You can add more specific information here, like the radius, secondary colors, typography and more. But for this case, I want to generate different design styles and I don't have a specific design style, so I can leave it only with the primary color. So for me, it's enough. The same prompt I created the minimalist design I used to create the scromorphism one, the climorphism one, neo brutalist, and more. Before you ask, I will add all the prompts in the description below. You can take it for there. Now let's move to your expired and start generating the screen with the different visual designs. I will explain how to create the screen with a basic CRM dashboard. First of all, here on the page setting, in the page setting, I write a very simple prompt, CRM software. You can add more information, but for that demonstration, it will be enough to explain you the result. Let's close it. In the context, I open it. Here I add the design styles that I showed you before. Now we will create a minimalist design. I copy the prompt I showed you before and paste it here. No more than that, very easy. Let's close this one. And below, as you can see here, I explain how the page should look. I explain the layout structure and the UI element like the sidebar and the cards. You can add here any information you want that describes the page you want to generate. And before I click generate, we must make sure that the high fidelity design is on. I select the standard model. In that case, I create a desktop application and also I turn on the deep design so the result will be much more accurate. I click on generate and let's see the result. And just to let you know that you can find the link to UX Pilot in the description below. Now let's continue. It's finished the work. Here's the dashboard UX Pilot created for us. Let's make a little bit zoom in. And you can see the visual design. We have the sidebar, all the elements that I asked it to add. And also you can see that the visual design of this page that we generated with UX Pilot, it's aligned with the minimalist design that asked it to do. Also, it's add the primary colors, the blue that I asked UX Pilot to add to the page. You can see that the results are very pleasant and it looks like a professional UI designer created this page. With a simple technique, you can create now different styles for your page. The only thing that you need to do is to change the prompt we added here on the context to the other prompts I will add in the description below. Let's see some example to see how it looks. This is the same page I created with the Beneteau style. You can see here that it looks like Beneteau style with the corners and the cards in the interface. This is the Neo Brutalist design. I change also the color. So the main color here is the yellow one. This is the Climorphism style with all the depth in the interface. Take a look here in that place. Let's zoom in. This is the Scumorphism and you can see that it looks like the Scumorphism Apple had when they launched the iPhone. And here's the developer style. You can see that it looks like software for developers, like ID software. So this is how it looks when I ask you to create a developer style interface. By the way, if you want to create another style and in the prompt that I share below, they are not exist. It's very easy to adapt the prompt that I shared below to any style you want to create. Let's move to ChatGPT to see how you can do it. I am in ChatGPT now. First of all, I ask ChatGPT to act like a UI designer and I add one of the prompts that I share with you from the description. In that case, it's the Beneteau grid. So I write it here and below I said to ChatGPT, now create the same for Neo Brutalist design style and it's adapt the prompt to the Neo Brutalist design style. So if you have another type of design style you want to use, like for example, dark mode, you just need to write instead of Neo Brutalist in that case, dark mode, and then it will adapt the prompt to dark mode. Remember that this technique is excellent if you work with a client, if you have an agency and you want to show them different style of interfaces so you can select with them the design style of the interface or also if you explore a new style, this is a great way to iterate very fast to understand what direction you want to take the product. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe. See you in the next one. Take care.